slavery, defined by race and perpetuated by creed. From the 15th to the 19th centuries, deplorable, dehumanizing. Grade 7s at Lars Kual Urs Park were transported back to the 1800s. Told to prepare an advertisement of a slave auction, they were given an example of a 1769 event. Pupils had to detail information such as the date, name of the ship, and the condition of the slaves. The last point refers to own ideas. The assignment had some parents and pupils fuming. Sure. For starters, who sends a this step why kill it to learn and the gross? Why, why, why are we going that back? If people are being taken as slave traders, that is actually not a very good thing. When we grow up, we will think about like selling other people to other people so they can work for them. You see. It's people from different places that they sold and they suffered a lot from my beliefs. There are also families went through pain and stuff. We have a problem here in South Africa about human trafficking. So I think the parent is going to think that when we grow up, we're going to be human traffickers too. The Human Rights Commission has slammed the assignment. What you're basically just saying to a bunch of kids is pretend to be a slave master and you're trying to sell your slaves. I mean, really? What, what lesson do I take out of that, actually? Yeah, nothing, nothing. Except for, because if I, if I put a, together a nice poster showing black people, and, you know, they're being sold for X amount of dollars and they have all their teeth, they're healthy, they fit, they're strong. I'm not, I'm basically just pretending to be a slave master and it's yeah. sort of a distant experience as opposed to the real experience of what <laughs> slavery meant. The school's deputy principal initially defended the assignment. Leave it, leave it, please. Okay, leave then it. you don't show it on me. Okay, fine. But he wouldn't comment on camera. Houghton Education has assured parents is taking the matter seriously. It's in the curriculum book, it's in a textbook that is used. So they just took the textbook and this is the sixth year uh, that the same assignment was, uh, was given. Uh, so, so, so you, you can't blame the HOD, you, you, it's just that we need to ensure what is the overarching thing that unites education and racialism is one of it. So if something of this nature is happening, uh, is it deliberate or the teacher was providing a lesson and that's the reason why our team is interviewing the affected team. But the preliminary report indicates that this is a formal textbook of the department that has been approved by the national department. So we just have to find other ways to determine whether this material is still relevant or not. The important bit is, is that we always need to understand why we're studying this stuff. Why do we um, even explore that aspect of human history? And that is to contextualize and to show where we've come from and where we should not return to. And I think that uh, this assignment, for example, uh, doesn't fully highlight or explicitly highlight the fact that this is a space in human history uh, that we should never ever find ourselves in again. Um, and this is what happened to actual uh, human beings with flesh and blood and, uh, you know, thoughts and, and hopes and dreams. Houghton Education is awaiting recommendations from stakeholders before deciding on the way forward. Mara Geta Mutabe, SABC News, Funder Bale Park.